uh, if you're going to export from Kahoot. So I'm going to come in here to uh, AP World History, and I'm going to open this, and I'm going to come over here to, the again, the three dots menu, and I'm going to click Reports. And then you'll see here that I have, every time you played the game, it will have a report available. So I'm going to, again, click the menu and download report. And I'm going to download it. And you could just save this in Google Drive and then copy into one of those templates, but I think it's easier if you actually use Excel. So once it's downloaded, uh, it's going to look like this, but you're going to see when you come over, you're going to actually see something that looks like this, right? Overview, and these are all the stats for your Kahoot. Final scores, Kahoot summary, right? Then these are the actual quiz questions. Well, you want to come all the way over at the bottom to where it says raw report data. And that is going to give you the question, your answer, choices, and then your correct answer. Now, this is you're going to have to do a little bit of editing here on the template. There is no specification on the on the GimKit template for correct answer, but I'm going to show you how we're going to do this. So you're going to copy all the cells that you want to bring over. So I've got 12 questions here with four answers, right? It's the first uh, seven columns. There we go. All right. So answer four. I don't want to copy the correct answer. So I'm going to copy that. Right. And then when I come over to my template, with the four answer choices, I paste and they all come in. Okay. And right now, uh, you'll see it says correct answer, incorrect answer. I'm going to have to change this later. Okay. And now I'm going to save this, uh, download it as an Excel file. And when I come back to GimKit, I say upload file, go to downloads, Mongols Kahoot import, and boom, all my questions are here. Now, what I need to do is I need to go through and edit these. So you notice this N, NBSP, you'll see that several times. Anytime there's a character and um, the app doesn't know what to do with it, it inserts this symbol, right? So you're going to have to get rid of those. So you just click here. And get rid of those. And that is the correct answer by chance. But if it was this and take their gold, I would just change the, you know, just edit the correct answer on there, save. And now I've got my entire Kahoot game in GimKit ready to go. All right. So that's the import process. Again, there are a few steps there, but it saves you from retyping absolutely everything that you had in Kahoot. Uh, and again, you can do the question and just the correct answer, and then it'll automatically add your distractors or wrong answers, or you can use the template that um, includes all four answers. And then you just, um, you know, you have to, you're going to have to manually edit which answer is correct. And, and then of course you want to download again, the comma separated value of this spreadsheet, no matter which one you choose. And then when you come to the kit, you can easily upload it. And all your questions are added. And you have successfully exported a question set from Kahoot and imported it as a kit in GimKit. And you are a champion of the app now. Next up, we'll take a look at how to do a similar thing with Quizlet.